Hey, what's up, everybody? Daddy Dave, Street Outlaws. So it's been a grueling 37 days of campaigning to win this captain's spot, the last captain's spot, and we ended up winning it uh, thanks to all you people that took time out of your day to vote, and get on there and vote again and vote again all throughout the day. It took all of you to do it, but we did it. We pulled it off. We won it. Fans, I first want to say thank you for participating in the voting. That is awesome. The participation was amazing. There were hundreds of thousands of votes for this deal. I mean, it's quite amazing. But the votes have been tallied. First, before I say who it is, who thinks it was Lizzie Music? Yeah. Who thinks it was Daddy Day? Yeah. Your eighth and final captain will be Daddy Day. Yeah. I'm extremely happy to be here to have the captain spot. Going into the draft, I think I picked one of the best teams you could possibly pick. Uh, I got two that were kind of unknowns, but uh, they've both proven to be pretty helpful and they're fast as hell. So I'm looking to have a really good season this year and try to win this team championship. During testing yesterday, we made we made some good hits. The first one, not so good. Come back, made a bar adjustment, did some other things, and then we went, went right down through the other second pass, and it was fast. Just fast. Yeah. Just fast. Yeah. Oh. Good run, buddy. Good run. Nice and straight down Broadway. We'll take that first round. Uh, so going into the first round, like you had to win that race to be able to be in on Virginia on the next event. So it was very important to win that round. Uh, I draw Jerry Burt. Oh, kick that ass. You need to man up. Put me in a bed. Again. Yeah. <laughs> you and you your chicken. Me and Jerry have a pass, and the last time we raced, he guessed the light and he beat me, and then he tried to beat me up down there on the big end. I didn't do you dirty! I didn't do you dirty! Uh, so me and Jerry got a run and joke with that, and that's all water under the bridge right now. But we lined up. <laughs> Took the trade, took the light, and I ended up winning that thing. So I am automatically in for Virginia, um, which is a huge load off 
anybody's shoulders. Uh, you never want to race your way in. If you fall behind for any reason, it is tough to crawl back into that uh, into that spot. Yesterday we had 40 racers. We raced down to 20. Uh, today we're going to race all the way down to Leonard. But the people that are in the final five spots, they are guaranteed the spot in the grade eight. Which in the grade eight is another individual championship that's on Friday and don't count for anything on Saturday. Uh, Saturday is strictly a team championship and Friday will be the individual through the grade eight. Just like it was last year, but you accumulate points to win the championship individual, but nothing counts towards Saturday. None of your points that you accumulate. So really cool deal. And it's a hundred thousand to win the individual It's 200,000 to win the team. So we're shooting for the team thing. I got a strong team this year. I think we're all going to do really good. The Audi is coming around. Um, I literally have 14 passes on this car. I'm getting more and more comfortable with it. It's getting faster and faster with every pass. Uh, today we're going to go out here. I draw Larry Larson first round. Larson switched to Pro Charger also. Um, I think he's struggling just like we are per se. I'm not really struggling, but we don't have the car figured out and it's not as fast as it possibly could be. I think Larry is in the same boat. So we're going to go out here. I'm going to put a tune up in it for the heat of the day. Go out here and let go of the button and see if we can beat this guy. So we went into today and I had Larry Larson first round. Uh, there's a little bit of history with Larry and the guy that built my car. Uh, so I need to get this win, not just for me or my team, but for my chassis builder. And uh, that's exactly what we did. It was a kind of fest. I ended up, um, like on the bottom, we go out there and it shakes the tires real bad. I pedaled it three or four times. And the last time I went to the floor with it, there was nothing there and the car had already shut up. And we're probably 500 foot out. And I thought, yep, here he comes. Larry's going to shoot around me at an 80 second. And it, he did not. Like my wind light turned on and I dodged a bullet on that one for sure. Come back to the pit. We trashed on it. We broke a bunch of stuff from the tire shake. Um, Johnny, me, uh, Jim, a bunch of us. Pro Charger was here. We thrashed on this thing. Got everything fixed to make next round. Uh, we drew David Gates and he ended up on Kai Kelly's team. Big nitrous motor, uh, extremely fast. He's had the car for a while. He's been testing it. Uh, he's got a handle on that thing. So we didn't take it lightly. I went in there with a tune up in it. Figured we had him covered and we did until about 300 foot. It went. Coming to tire shake again. I pedaled a bit once and he went around me. So he put me out. Um, first time out with a car, I am not disappointed at all. The thing. It's working. It's going to all last. We just got to figure out what it likes and where it likes it. For my team, uh, Caleb Ward was my first draft pick. Uh, my whole team is solid. Um, Axeman went out the round before me. One of my guys had catastrophic failure. He kicked a rod through the motor, and the other guy just got outran. But we got a pretty solid team. Caleb went all the way to the finals.
Great job. Ooh, okay. Good way to start it off. Here we go. If you want to start a season, by your ear, think of you. Congratulations, Caleb Martin. She won the invitation of today. She won Ohio. So, a pretty much set a statement for my team going into Virginia. Extremely happy that I'd won the, the captain's choice. Uh, I think I put a good team together, and we're uh, we're looking to set a set the tone for this year and take the championship. So, uh, just stay tuned. We'll have more of these uh, cover every event this year and uh, some behind the scenes stuff. So, just stay tuned. Man, wish us luck.